sausage. I got my barbecue shoes on. I'm going down to the house for sausage. I got my barbecue shoes on. Welcome to barbecuepitboys.com. Today we're cooking up some Chinese style wings on the grill, and it's real easy to do. All right, here I've got some fresh washed chicken wings ready to go. There's a few pounds there. And it's a real easy recipe. You're going to need uh, jalapeno for this. You're going to need some ginger. You're going to need some uh, green onion. You're going to need some garlic. You're going to need some Asian barbecue sauce. It's called hoisin sauce. You're going to need some rice wine vinegar. You're going to need some soy sauce. So let's just put it together, and it's real easy to do. All right, I'm going to chop up some veggies first, and uh, you don't need to see how to do this, so uh, we'll just uh, get these done first. All right, through the miracle of time, the veggies have been chopped. Now let's put this uh, sauce together, all right? It's real easy. You're going to need a half a cup of rice wine vinegar. Now, if you can't find a rice wine vinegar, you could substitute a good uh, table vinegar. And you're gonna need a half a cup of soy sauce. Now, if you've never cooked up some Asian style uh, wings at your pit, you're missing something out of your life, you better check this out. All right, now here I have two tablespoons of uh, Chinese dipping sauce. It's called hoisin sauce. And to that, I'm gonna add one tablespoon of minced ginger, one tablespoon of scallions, one uh, seeded chili pepper, and one tablespoon of uh, minced garlic. You give it a mix, and now the sauce is ready for our wings. Easy enough. Man, that smells good. All right, our marinade and mopping sauce is done. We have to thank the uh, Taiwan chapter of the Barbecue Pit Boys for uh, turning this on to us. Man, this is some real good eating, man. All right, now, next thing we're going to do here is we're going to prep these wings a bit. Now, like I said, these rings are already washed and prepared. And uh, what I like to do here is we're going to uh, snap the drumette just a little bit. We're just going to straighten it out. This helps it uh, when we're ready to put this on the skewers. You just grab it and you kind of break it. Now, you don't have to break it all the way through. The whole idea is you want to uh, straighten these wings out just a little bit. All right few in here now you're going to want to make a lot of these wings because uh, they go real fast at your pit all right easy enough now we're going to take this uh marinade here we're going to pour a good bunch of it all over these wings just for a bit and we're going to save some for mopping give it a good mix now, some will tell you to throw these in the refrigerator overnight. I don't know what they're thinking. Your idea here is to create layers of flavor. Chicken wings contain some real good tasting chicken. You don't want to marinate it overnight. Just an hour at the most. In fact, sometimes you don't even have to marinate at all. We're just going to get some flavors in there. And if you marinate it for too long, all you're going to do is taste your marinade. What good is that? All right. Now, we're going to put these wings on the skewers. And uh, what you do here is uh, you start at the drumette end and you take these skewers and uh, you just drive it right up along the bone. And you can feel along the bone there with your skewer. You just want to be real careful you don't uh, stab yourself. Now we've all stabbed ourselves and it can hurt. So you just be careful doing this. And for those who haven't done this before, I'm going to show you a few more times. Again, go right alongside the bones there, just like that. Now, the great thing about this recipe here is it's uh, real quick and easy to do. It's perfect for tailgating or uh, something to eat after you get home from work, family picnic, whatever. You want to make a bunch of them, like I said. All right. All right, there's nothing left to do now but put these on the fire. And now we've got a medium heated fire and we're gonna do it directly over the coals. And like I said before, these are only gonna take a few minutes to do. 
the trick is you want to be mopping and flipping. Oh yeah. Now you're gonna take your mopping saws here and keep hitting. Yeah. And that's the trick. Keep that mopping saws coming along there. Keep flipping those wings. Whoa. I think you get the picture. Getting hungry or what? <laughs> All right, these wings are done. It's only taken a few minutes. And uh, we're going to place them indirect here to keep them nice and warm your uh, friends that are at the pit, all right? And we're gonna keep adding some more wings on there. Same procedure. Get them over them medium coals. Start hitting with the mop. Man, they smell so good, I can hear the uh, food police come. Keep that mop coming. Give him a flip. Now, of course, we could have shortened this video a bit, but uh, I kind of like doing this. And uh, if you don't have the patience, you hit that uh, fast forward button right down there in front of you. But uh, we're just going to keep showing you. Oh, man. It's good. Take a look at that. Can you smell that? It smells good. So now you get the method to the madness here, and uh, again, a lot of mopping, a lot of flipping, and they're done in a few minutes. Real good. Now I'm going to make up a bunch more here. As I said, it's time to eat. So the next time you're looking for a recipe for your barbecue, you check out the barbecuepitboys.com.